Against Illinois, but Purdue will win. I just. What now? What's this part. now? Now hold on. But the, I might the, have to erase that part. They're both part of the, the finals. Yeah, in the yeah, yeah. Don't, the don't, I don't know. Well, let's just take a wide view here. Oh, whoa! Wait a minute. Somebody's calling me. Okay. How do we do on that one? Going piece? to help on here. We're going up on this. Let's go, Andy. Come on. Come on, Andy. Come on. Look at all these beautiful people. Camera at work. Okay. Is that really filming? Yes, it's filming right now. As we go up the stairs. Okay. There's, there's our teacher. Oh, right, you're not getting me on it. Are you recording? Yes, it's recording. It's recording right now. Let's go back down the stairs. No, I refuse to let some great Cooper at their so music. Wait, 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 wait. We got it. We got to get this person on film. There he is. His dad owns Chick Fil A, by the way. Are you gonna come or what? I'm like, get the Chick Fil A man. Oh, wait, but of course, the Purdue fan wants to get more oh, yeah. on film. Purdue, no. Purdue and Illinois are two decent basketball players. What'd you say about players. six years or so? You'll be playing basketball for Purdue. Turn to right? yourself. Yeah. Turn, uh -oh. turn toward yourself. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> well, let's see. Oh, there's Why Annie. Such a goody goody, helping out everybody. Church lady. One and all. Oh, she's coming down here to beat me up right that. now. I'm gonna go take that from the Walmart. Okay. Yeah. Hold on a minute. Okay, we'll be back in a minute. Oh. <laughs> Lovely people in close close and mall too. Much. Hi. Roving camera for David Letterman. <laughs> <laughs> okay. We're gonna find some more interesting people here. On the way. Hi, how are you? Turn in here. Okay. Uh, and here we are at the gold mine, folks. Hey, Paolo, the Paolo. The camera yeah. for David Letterman. Who wants to be on David Letterman here? Wait a minute. Okay, there's Paul. Get out of here. Is my mom already here? One of the sticky people who work at this dump. As we continue. Oh, look at that. You guys, Let's join you. We all have to move one way or else the screen will move. That's, that's really talented, isn't it? As he, oh, wait, somebody has me by the back. Somebody has me by the back, folks. Hold on a minute. Hold on, let's see who this person is. <laughs> Maybe can I... Are you fighting kids to kick me out? Oh wait, here's, here's an interesting game that I've played many times. Rampage, oh, here, what, 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 <laughs> what? Wait, 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 play... hey, 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 don't you want to see me play? Hey, Mr. Cameraman, what game do you want me to play? I, I would like you to play this one. All right, so Rampage. You? How are you going to help me? Who are you going to be? Play? No. The werewolf, the lizard, or the... Oh, here we I go. Know, I just put my quarter in. Okay, I'll be this guy. Okay, okay. he's going to be the gorilla. Okay, we're going to join Andy in on this. Anyway, so it's not bad. Okay, here he is. Oh, there he is down there. See him? See him moving? Hit the truck. Hit the truck? How do I hit it? Whoa! Andy, you are not a talent, I'll tell you that. I see the spread. Ouch! You goon head. As he's going up the other side, this is out of focus, but that's the best side to get here. Look at him destroy those buildings. Oh, and here goes, get those helicopters up there, Andrew. You missed the helicopters, they're going to shoot on you now. Ah, I blew them up! Oh, just die already. Let me help you here, Andy. <laughs> oh, oh. He's going to be kind here. Oh, oh, no. Well, oh, look at that. Blew him up. Look at it, right? Oh, just nailed that helicopter. Good job. Come on, hurry up and die already. Wait, here I go. Oh, I'm going to get that out of the game. Let's say goodbye to Paul, our good friend. <laughs> Watch David Letterman on Friday night and he gets up. More nice people. Hello. Okay. Oh, this is close to the mall here. Everybody, from the, from everybody wants to be in on the beautiful camera shop here. Beautiful people that work in these stores too. Roman camera, David Letterman. Okay. We continue on our way. Now, let's, let's, We're Baskin Ramen. Let's go to Baskin Ramen. Come over this way, where everybody else is. Okay, we're going over here. Excuse me, David Letterman, camera. Phone. David Letterman here. David, David, 
Yeah. yeah, get your words straight. Sorry, we can't turn around, sir. You're gonna have to catch up to us. Beautiful people, look at the luggage. They just bring it on in here. As look, we're coming upon a clan of people. A big clan. Excuse me, David Letterman it's camera coming through. David Letterman here. Oh. Let's see here. Wait, wait, wait. No, no, don't grab onto the cameraman's arm. Film the girl. Film the girl. Okay. Oh, wait a minute. Here's an interesting person. You're too close to the camera, Chip. You're blurring out everything. And there he is. What an interesting person. Look at the intermediate. This is an intermediate. There's an intermediate person. Look at Ryan. Look at our hero. Look at our hero. Look, look at the person I give the ice cream. What's your name? Yo, Mrs. Ice Cream Lady. <laughs> hey, let me do some more. Oh, she, she won't take this infernal Ryan. 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 Yes, I am. Ryan, you're filming. I've been filming ever since the beginning. Ryan, film it. I want Let's you go bother some people. Lady, Tony. Hey, right, who is this? Tony. Tony, just turn around one. Hello. Let me, let me uh, film so I can get you two. Uh, isn't that sweet? Hi. <laughs> Let me film some film. No, I don't know what you film. Roman camera, David Letterman. How are you doing, sir? Oh, hi. Oh, there he is again. As There's I'm an interesting person. Film the, film this the is the bank. the bank. Hi there, Ryan. Watch this, watch this, watch this. Oh. You're in the film. way, you're in the way of the film. film. You're in the way of the film. Hello, hello, Andy. How are you doing? What are you doing? You're too close to the camera. Whatever you're doing. No, I refuse to. Ryan, <laughs> Okay, wait, should we go into into this beautiful place of ice cream? All right. Okay, we're we're entering the. Where is she? Uh, there she is. Behind you. lady's daughter. Get the mirror behind. <laughs> oh. <laughs> hey, hey, hey! Watch the little thing. <laughs> no, it'll break. <laughs> okay. Let's see here. Look at all these interesting clothes. Oh, whoa. Ryan, 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 Ryan. <laughs> Lord, I'm my brother. Okay. Okay. That's it. This is exactly what we'll do. More people. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm putting this up. Oh, beautiful people working here. Hi, how are you today? Oh, hi. Hi. You're taking my picture. Roman camera for David Letterman. Oh, okay. Be sure to put us in the candle shop. Okay, the kiss <laughs> candle shop. Where are you located here in Costa Mall? You're near um, the what exit? I'm here? right next door to Choppers and in between the ice cream store. Okay. okay. Well, I'm we'll make sure we tell a lot of people. And I'm okay. From and you're from Connecticut? I'm from Connecticut. Okay. From Connecticut. Thanks for telling us that. My friend's from Connecticut. Okay, let's leave. I'm not sure. I would go into the bank, but I could be arrested in it. Let's go into Chompers Pizza. Let's go into See what kind of nice people are in Chompers here. Let's go watch some music videos. We're in Chompers now. Hi. This is Roman Camera for David Letterman. Uh-oh. <laughs> Some people aren't too friendly if you're here. <laughs> what did he say? He just kind of looked at me like, what are you doing? Hi. Roman Camera, David Letterman. Watch Tuesday night, next week. Watch and you'll be hey, on hey, David. come on, go. Okay. He's not showing. He's not look, look at the look, filming. Look at the down at the bottom. Oh, oh, what? Okay. Oh, oh, Andrew. Andrew. <laughs> Don't mind the cameraman. <laughs> Okay, come on, let's go over to a different store. No, I, I want to do something okay, just a little on. bit. We'll be back in a Where are you from again? Trumbull, Connecticut. Trumbull, okay, so... Trumbull. Trumbull. Okay, I'll tell my friend as soon as we... Right into David Letterman and, um... We'll show this little part here. How, how does that sound to you? Where's David This is the co-producer of David Letterman. David Letterman's a TV show. Oh, at night? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Late that, night at David Letterman. Is that what Letterman? that is? Yeah. You may not be on there? Yeah. yeah. You mean it? Yeah. I don't believe it. I uh, watch what's him all your the name? time. What's your name? We'll turn it in. That Giuliano. Giuliano. Okay. Five, one, struggle roll. All right, we'll turn it in. Okay, we'll turn it in. Don't forget. Okay. Whoa, whoa. Oh, we're there. making it out here. Hello. Are you a nice person? Oh, look. Oh, uh, can you recognize him? All right. Okay, you'll all be on David Letterman. Bye. Bye. Jimmy, okay. Jimmy, let's, no, no, get away, get away. We're that girl. I was that girl.
Shoe place? Let's go to the shoe place where ooh, where we will find Edith. <laughs> right, would you like to join me here? Oh sure. Are you gonna come with me? Yeah. Beautiful. Oh, that's Marilyn Monroe. Where? Oh yeah. Oh, oh. You a big guy. Uh, real big guy. Yeah, he's got pretty colors. Oh, he does have pretty colors, huh? See, he's really obsessed with the video. Hey Ryan, where did Chris go? Oh, this is little Honorio. You haven't been in the film yet. Hi. I'm always going to wide view here. State your name. Honoria Jenya. Keep that smile. More interesting people. It's like being flocked by sheep here on the mall. Well, somebody said hi to me. I didn't even know who it was. They go, hi, Rodin. I didn't even know who it was. I just said hi. Well, this is getting hi. That's an interesting man. Hey, let's go to the dentist shop. Should we, should we go into the dentist shop? Yes. Okay. We're going to the dentist services. A request by the Purdue fan himself. And we certainly, yeah, Roman Camera, David Letterman, how are you? Obviously not well enough. <laughs> Let's continue on our way here. This is, what is this called again? Hi, how are you? It's a Roman Camera for David Letterman. Okay. Hi. Hi. What's your name? Smile. Okay, you don't have to say your name. Okay, let's go. <laughs> yes, can I help you something? This way. You want to show yourself, yeah, you lame. Oh, forget it, forget it. Let's go on yeah. here. Hi, how are you? Hi. This is Roman Camera for David Letterman. Fox? In Naples. How are you filming? Yes. Cool. Yeah, so what is the name of your store here? We're the Soft Touch 2, the florist shop. Hmm. Okay, well, make sure I stop by here. Okay. Okay, thank you. Welcome. Nice store you have here. Okay. We're on our way. Oh, and there's Edith coming out of the... We'll go to the shoe store. Oh, she, yeah, she turns her head. Oh, let's go let's to Mr. Galata. Let's go to the luggage store. Should we go in here? Luggage. Hi, how are you? Roman camera for David Letterman. Well, some people are speechless with excitement, as you can see here. Let's continue on our way. <laughs> Take a picture of Mr. Galata. <laughs> see, what is this? What, give me the name of the store here. This is Lonex. Oh, wait a minute. Let's see, I see they have a sign that says, Please leave food and drink outside. We better not bother them. They have customers. Okay. Should we? We've been through here. Um, okay, we're gonna say goodbye. For, okay, let's go back through here. We're going to this place called Keys, etc. Is that what it's called, Eddie? Yeah. And there's all those lovely oh, this geeks. Oh, where everybody went. Especially Andy. <laughs> let's go through here. This is Keys, etc. Hi. Hi. How are you? Hello. Are you? Roman camera for David Letterman. In Naples. For who? David Letterman. How nice. Yeah. Okay, this is a store called Keys, etc. Yes. And I just see lovely people. 
coming to the store. The lovely displays. And they advertise for the store. And so I hear somebody calling. So we're going for to Chick Fil A. Let's go. Come on. We're, oh, we're going to Chick Fil A. Right. Okay, this store will interest you, okay, you and amaze you. Okay, okay, and there he is. And he better move out of the way before the cameraman runs him over. Because there he is. Oh. Oh yeah. Chip, Chip loves to be on film, obviously, and is very disgusting on film. Hi, how are you? Roman camera, David, or whatever. I'm getting used to saying that, you know. Hi. Hello, you're on camera. Roman camera, David Letterman. Hi. This is Zales Jewelers. I could put you into there as we pass by. You're on candid camera. Oh, let's go on to Colorado. Yeah, with a nice star. Hi, how are you? Roman camera, David Letterman. And this is a nice store. It really is. We get. Hi. Oh. Oh. Well, some people don't like us, but as you come around here, beautiful things in this store. Let's go. Oh, it's entertaining. As more people bother us. <laughs> Why are you doing this? I know. <laughs> okay, we're coming up upon Chick fil A. Hello? It's Chick fil A. Restaurant didn't belong here. So. Are you following me? Hold on, nice. Oh, there she is again. The ice cream lady. <laughs> the ice cream lady? Oh. Well, this wasn't as interesting as we thought it would be. Shall we head down to the. Blue section here? You, you guys stick with me now. It's only me. Okay, I know where we're going to go. Don't be with us except for me. Okay, well, you'll be my vice cameraman. Let's go over to this Chinese food place. I know there's nice people here. Hi, how are you doing today? Roman camera, David Letterman. <laughs> and what's this? Golden Dragon, okay? Yeah, watch, Golden Dragon. watch next Tuesday night, David Letterman, and you'll be on film. What's your name? I'm Jimmy Sue. Okay, Jimmy Sue. I'll be down here for dinner later on, okay? Okay. Thanks sure. a lot. Bye. Continue on our way. Hi, people. Roman camera, David Letterman. Thank you. Hi. Hi, how are you? This is the this is Skyline Chili in the mall. And what's your name? I'm Linda. Hi, Linda. And this is the Roman camera for David Letterman. And uh, watch Tuesday night. Oh, and here's this is on Channel 7. Okay, you watch. Hi, how are you doing today, people? I know I am, but it's fun sometimes. It's it's weird and hung in us. Oh, that was not too nice to say. I'll remember that. I see what she blown away. Oh, she's gone. As we we flocked her away, Maria. It was pretty good. Well, we better not go in here. That's a little bit too snazzy for us. Well, we're going to say goodbye for a minute here because my shoulder's going to We're back to the main part of the mall. This is Mr. and Mrs. Galata. How are you doing? How are you doing? Yeah, how'd you like the concert? Fine. Good. Tell them what this is. Like at minimum, like Johnny Carson says you get $640 to be on television. Well, I don't know about that. Mr. Letterman, how are you today? Oh, and here's Kevin. Where have you been, Kevin? You're too close to the camera. Ah, uh, there you are. Yes. yes. Are you filming this? Yes, I'm filming this. All right, Mr. Mr. Letterman. And Chris. Wait a minute, wait a minute. That's not playing. <laughs> Should we go into a store? Joe's down at the other store. Let's go into a store. Let's go no, to no, let's go to Bentley's. Okay, we're going let's, into Bentley's. You come with me. Let's go to Bentley's. Do you notice that Kevin's trying to get into the film a lot? <laughs> well, no. Here we are, Wait, do you mind if we, if we in film? Bentley. <laughs> this is for Roman camera for David Letterman. For what? Oh, okay. <laughs> and we come along here. It's a long store. <laughs> lined with things. Is that really on it? Yeah. Well, it is just filming. What's your name? <laughs> Lonnie. Hi, Lonnie. Well, we got Lonnie in our orchestra. We have a Lonnie in our orchestra. You look much better than she does, though. I, I get about four, five times. All right. Lonnie? Thank you very much. This okay. is Mr. Rogers here. Okay, folks. I think Kevin now that we're neighbors, bit, okay. let's go in here. <laughs> We Come did, on now. We have got to go into this store. This is the only one where we haven't been Come into yet. Come on, <laughs> For fun. <laughs> Hi, how are you? We're the David this Letterman. is a Roman camera for David Letterman. <laughs> do you work here? Are you? Hi, how are you? What can I do for you? Oh, nothing. We're just roaming around in the mall, <laughs> shooting pictures of everybody. Kevin, are you having a heart attack of some sort? Wait a minute. Oh, I know a friend that works at McDonald's. Let's go film a film. Hey, is Tasha working today? Your head's in the way, Chip. 
Oh, everybody has ice cream except Hello. Kevin, who's in the film all the time. No, okay. I'm not Kevin. I'm Mr. Rogers. Oh my God. Now that we're neighbors, let's go in here. Should we go in here? Oh, somebody's up my back, and somebody's grabbing onto the camera, and I don't like people who touch the camera. And it's a chip. <laughs> Drop the baby. This kid's yeah, tearing yeah. up your store. His name's uh, Kevin. No, I'm Mr. Rogers. Uh, okay. Let's well, film that Chico. Okay, wait a minute. Let's go to. Let's go to. Let's um, El Chico. No, no, no. Um. Oh yeah, Edith. Get away from. Look at look look at the look. She's got braces like brother, big old brother Pablo. Get out of here. Let's let's go, go bother bother church lady's daughter. Hey, wait wait wait. We're catching up. Yeah. She does. I know. I noticed. There's Church Lady's daughter. The games are in the backstretch now. In fact, a few events closed out with the finals this afternoon. All in all, though, the Prairie State games are going along quite nicely. Thank you. Of course, some of the bigger name basketball players taking part over at the Assembly Hall, including the present, past, and future when it comes to Illinois hoops. In fact, in a game played bright and early this morning at the Hall, six guys with ties to the Illini involved is Glenn Blackwell. Popped in a three right there. He's still got the touch. Of course, one of Lou Hansen's past greats. Lou was taken in the games this morning in the cheap seats. He's uh, been to a bunch of games this weekend, as a matter of fact. I've seen them all over the place. Lou's had to like this, though. Backcourt mates, Steve Bardo and Larry Smith. Larry feeding Steve for the layup. Hopefully, we'll see a lot of that coming up next year. Bardo and Smith playing for the Southern region, while one of the newcomers with the Blue-Gray team, Andy Petty, the short jump hook right there. That looks pretty good for the front line next year. And the guy that lit up the assembly hall all of last year does it again. This time, though, from the outside. Kenny Battle on his way to the NBA and the Phoenix Suns knocked down the three-point right there. He and Blackwell led the Blue Gray on the win. Don't forget the final game for the men tomorrow, 1 p.m. at the Assembly Hall. That's Rodney Jones, another Illini putting that one in. The final this morning, the Blue Gray 127 to 113 over the Southern Region. I don't know how he gets this far. Under the links, tomorrow's final round for the in fact, there's a severe thunderstorm watch out for portions of Eastern. Kind of in here. They were taking on Blue Gray in the uh, final game. But you got to watch this passing here. They get it into Rodney Jones. He's one of the newcomer for Illinois. Blackwell into Jones right there. Gets it in off the layup. And here's something that we've grown accustomed to. Kenny Battle moves right around Pemberton for the slam. The Blue Gray, the winners this afternoon. Hi, Ed. How are you? Hi, Connie. We're good. We've been watching you for half an hour. You're doing a great job. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Ed. It's interesting to watch people answer questions without knowing the question. <laughs> yeah, but by now you can probably figure out what the question is, can't you? Okay. Connie, uh, it's probably fair to say that most Americans don't know who Vernon Johns is. In fact, it's probably fair to say most black Americans don't know who Vernon Johns is. Can you tell us right. something about him and, and how this story came to the center of attention? Well, we had, our executive producer, Andy Lack, had read about Vernon Johns in the Pulitzer Prize winning book called Parting the Waters by Taylor Branch. And he, Vernon Johns is the first chapter. The book is about Martin Luther King, but what the uh, historian who wrote the book realized was that the man who laid the foundation for the civil rights movement was Vernon Johns. He preceded Martin Luther King at the Dexter Avenue Baptist Church in Montgomery, Alabama in 1949. And he was this fiery, fiery black preacher who uh, was delivering a message to the black middle class congregation they weren't ready to hear the uh, the parishioners there were uh, not prepared to step into a uh, the, the social movement that was about to uh, embark because his message was a little too well it was not nonviolent unlike Martin Luther King who was delivering a nonviolent message so when Vernon Johns left and when the congregation selected um, Martin Luther King to replace him, they were then ready, and they marched in the Montgomery bus boycott uh, with their hearts and souls in it. Um, Vernon Johns is uh, died 24 years ago. There's no tape of him, there's no film of him, so we interviewed people who knew him well, and then we asked James Earl Jones to portray him. Is is the section with, or the segment with James Earl Jones, is that going to be a regular feature of Saturday Night with Connie Chung? 
it's somewhat similar. In other words, if we are doing a story on someone who uh, cannot come before a television camera, is uh, maybe incarcerated or whatever, it's our attempt to tell a story that can't be told another way. And so there will be times when we will be asking someone to portray this person so that we can tell his or her story. Now, is the Vernon John story a full hour, or how much of the show does that make up? It's about a half an hour, and then coming out of that half hour, we asked his daughter to join us. Her name is Tony Johns Anderson, and she, she reacts to the story. She tells us uh, whether or not we captured her father, and uh, then we expand it a little bit, try to move the story forward. We interview Jesse Jackson and the mayor of Montgomery, Alabama, the current mayor, and we're trying to find out in that segment if Vernon Johns' message, was, which is that the black middle class was complacent then. We ask if that message is as relevant today as it was yesterday. Can you give us any hint about future shows? I realize you haven't even got the first one on the air yet, but what about the future? Well, we, we, we do lots of other types of stories. I spent the summer traveling around doing interviews. Some of them are one-on-one -on -one interviews with personalities, and some are sort of your traditional magazine stories. Um, but we also do this particular type of story that I described to you, like the one about Vernon Johns. And, uh, and we're dealing with sort of the bigger issues, but we're taking an untold part of it. Uh, issues such as abortion, AIDS, uh, uh, death penalty. Okay. Uh, any other people in, involved in Saturday Night with Connie Chung that we're going to recognize? Are there reporters who we're going to recognize? Or are, are, you, are you doing it all? I am just about doing most of it. We may have a contributor uh, uh, down the road, and but uh, we're keeping him a big secret, and we'll let you know as soon as he's ready. <laughs> okay, Connie, they tell me we're out of time for that. Thank you so much. Thank you, Ed. Okay. <coughs> okay? All right. In five seconds. Four, three, two... Remember the stories that left an imprint on all of us? Stories you saw unfold on Channel 3 News and remain in your thoughts long after they're filed away in black and white. Well, for every story, there's an untold story. And for every untold story, I'll be here on Saturday night. Join me for Saturday Night with Connie Chung, Saturdays at 9 p.m., followed by the Channel 3 News at 10, here on Channel 3. Clear? Uh, sure. Sure. Just tell me when. Okay. <clears throat> okay. Connie, I think it's fair to say that most Americans don't know who Vernon John Johns is. In fact, it's probably fair to say most black Americans don't know who he is. How did Vernon Johns come to be the, uh, the center of uh, this first uh, episode of your new show? Okay. Okay. You don't need a follow-up. Now, do you want me to do the audio again? Do you want him to do the audio again? It's up to him. Up to you. Okay. Connie, it's probably fair to say that most Americans don't know who Vernon John <laughs> falls to his six and a tray. Chris, as the decade of the 80s comes to a close on Sunday night, Chris Fowler now takes a look back on some of the shots that made the 80s a vintage time for college basketball. Here's a drive by Capehart. Capehart going in. Capehart blocked by Skeeter Roberts. Boy, did he get a great block. Jackson got a shot away. Go!
basketball in the 80s, filled with the excitement of buzzer beaters and the long, long, long shots like U.S. Reed's winner for Arkansas. Michael Jordan again for North Carolina. Lorenzo Charles for 1984.